are now listening to Chi Chi's Radio Show. Welcome back, night birds. Our heroes are fast asleep in the spinning wheel van. This is the exact opportunity Nightmare Fanny needs to exact her plan. You're going to blow my cover. Sorry. <sighs> okay. Everyone's asleep except for Renee. But she looks pretty zoned out driving and listening to the radio. She shouldn't be an issue. But now, for this to work, I'm gonna need to hop through them all without being seen. Showing their worst fears and regrets through a controlled nightmare. I think I've got enough information on Kane's friends to work with. <sighs> Let's do this. Sour acid first. Ooh, a paparazzi! I must be dreaming! Hi, everyone! You're not here for me, are you? Hello? Can you see me? There she is! Renee, how does it feel to have your latest hit, Crumbled Love, win you an aria? Our song. I'm very grateful for this award. I'm glad this song I wrote touched the hearts of so many people. Hey, we wrote that song together. We heard a rumor that you co-wrote the song with another friend. Is that true? Yes, it is. Why can't anyone hear me? I did have a friend that I wrote songs with, but she hides on the ground from everyone. She might as well not exist. If I stay here, no one can see me. I could never sing with Renee. I have to leave the tribe. Success! That's one down. I'll go for Tarantula and Widow next. They've got two different minds, but they share one body. I wonder if I can make them share a nightmare. Only one way to find out. Are we back home? I think we might be sharing a dream. This is so weird. And this is our latest complete one. Experiment 461. Combining two lifelike mechanisms in one body. Sure. They may look a bit freakish to you, but in the hands of the magnificent monster circus, they'll be stars. A circus, huh? Yep. Our latest experiment, number 462, has been built by using blueprints from these guys. Could you show your executive friend the new one? I'll be there in a minute. Sure. Right this way, sir. Hey guys, don't be so nervous about this circus opportunity. I know you think you are a freak. You're always trying to hide widow when we do live tours. Don't ever hide or be ashamed of yourself, okay? Everyone will love you. Okay, Daddy. All right. Is everything all right? No. First test on 462 have gone haywire. Raymond's gone off to record the experiment log, so we need your help to deactivate. I'm on my way. And remember, guys, no more hiding who you really are. No one did that day. And here we are, still hiding away instead of showing everyone how cool we are to be. Just like we're so wanted. Are you thinking what I'm thinking? Yep, I'm we have leaving to the trap. That sure was depressing. Let's take a break and go for Jason next. He'll be a light snack compared to them. Huh? This is so peaceful. No one could have a deep fear at a place like this. Ah! I'm back here again? What do you want from me, Dad? I apologize for pushing you in the lake. I apologize every night before bed. Oh, God. You and Mom are haunting me, aren't you? Your icy ghost have followed me. I can't do this again. I have to leave the tribe. Okay. Fearing next. I... I, I know this place. These... These bodies. Are all your 
jobs I assigned. Mirror? In the, well, I was gonna say flesh, but, you know, I'm an animatronic. I'm like the amalgamation standing in front of me. You, you made me this way. You made me a killer. And you certainly did a good job at it. But something changed in you. The day Simon executed that kid. Well, Daniel wasn't dangerous like the others. He wasn't running a corrupt business or harassing people on the street. He didn't deserve it. He was making you soft. Someone like that was going to help us bring justice. So we had to do what we had to do. But it didn't make you any stronger. Instead, you ran away and hid underground. You act tough for your new friends, but they don't see the coward you really are. No. No. No, I'm not a coward. I'm not. I have to avenge Daniel and take that psycho down. on him from time to time, but for now, it's time for the grand finale, Kane. He's the one who's been the hardest to convince, despite wanting this the most. Every time he seems ready to leave, Chi Chi always pulls him back. I don't know if his friend's leaving is a permanent solution. I don't even know if showing his fears will work. <sighs> I don't want to do this to him, but he's been stubbornly staying by her, so I don't have a choice. I have to break him. Huh? I'm back at the cafe? In a cage? Morning! Here's my little pet cupcake! You are, yes you are! Chi Chi, what are you doing? I'm not an animal. Now, we have a snuggle session scheduled for 6am. At 8am, I'll take you for a walk in the cage, of course. Can't let you run away. Uh, that should take us to a 10 a.m. where I watch old people crap on TV while you sit beside me in case I get angry. Which, yeah, will definitely happen. And when it does, I'll need you to sing the lullaby for me 50 times. Then we have a venting session for 6.30. Just for me, though, you don't have any issues more important than mine. Uh, that should take us to 1 a.m. where we'll have some sleep and repeat it all again tomorrow. Real subtle nightmare, Vanny. Nightmare, Vanny? Are you talking to someone else? Oh, no, 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 no. I can't let you be with anyone else but me! JJ, calm down. Wait, what am I saying? This isn't actually happening. Sing me the song, can you please? I'm freaking out! I don't have to. This is just a dream. I can do whatever I want. Go wherever you I want. You can't! It always worked to my daughters. 
not putting them in a death loop, obviously, but repeatedly punishing them until they learn their lesson. They'll scream and cry at you to stop, but you'll have to keep going because you know it's best for them. It's called tough love, and you'll be getting this every night until you leave Chi Chi. No, please don't do this. Sorry, Kane. You've left me no choice. Ooh, here she comes. I'll leave you to it. Morning! Here's my little pet cupcake. You are. Yes, you are. No! Woo! Fingers crossed that works. What the heck are you? Ah! Look out! Koka! Oh! <laughs> Wait a sec. Quokka's not really see us. Well, where'd she go? Did any of you see that? No, <laughs> we just woke up because you, you swarmed the band. Sorry. <laughs> hey guys, we've been thinking, but we're going to leave the tribe to chase our circus dream. We hope you will understand. Uh, that's okay, I, I was going to leave too. Really? Me too. Uh, it seems like we're all thinking of leaving. How peculiar. I wonder if this has something to do with that demon shimmer console. But I'm gonna wait until after the Battle of the Bands concert next week. I want to support our new friends. Plus, we got a wicked view. Aw, uh, I appreciate it, guys. I just hope Kane's okay waiting another week. He seems keen to go. Well, he's still helping with the concert, isn't he? Yeah, he is. So I think he'll be okay being here for another week. I mean... What's the worst that could happen? So, our monstrous friends are sticking around to watch the show. And then we'll leave the chase their dreams. Ooh, next week is the competition. I'm so excited. Who do you think will win? Let us know in the comments. But until then, subscribe to the channel so you know when the next episode will be uploaded. Thanks for listening. <laughs>